Hey everyone, this is Manly Badass Hero, and welcome back to Lisa the Pointless. Previously, we took on the Great Arnold, and then we found ourselves surrounded and were forced to make a daring escape. Thank you, Mysterious Symbolic Crow. Waiting for someone. So now I'm young, Alex. When did you go up against? Well, the Armstrongs. With Grandmasters from around the globe arriving to compete, be sure to attend this tremendous event. What? What? Let's hit those lockers. Oh god, I'm the bad guy from the Karate Kid. Oh, just like a nice guy. Especially compared to Brad. I don't fail. Come watch me fight. Finger memes. So am I fighting? Some dude? Ooh, it's an actual fight. Keto stance. Go with Fu. We have the goat kick. And the flying axe kick. Let's advance towards the enemy. Then we'll goat kick DDD. Is he gonna like CQC me and just flip me over and kill me instantly? Damn. Relax stance. I 
I need to wait to get his stance gone. You just put the stance right back up. One turn. Two turn. Three turn. He loses on the third turn. One. Two. Three. One, two, if he does it, he's going to do it here, maybe do it here, <laughs> so that attack, he, he just wants to be over, damn, this is sad, damn you for a karate kid, it's 2-0. I'm not gonna drop this damn thing if I can do it with the minor iris. WAS. One. Two. Three. One. Two. If he's gonna drop it, it's gonna be here. Damn. Keep going. I'm gonna beat you, karate kid. A trick kick. I feel like that's gonna like... They are not supposed to forfeit after all. <laughs> oh, what are you doing, Judge? It's legitimate. The legitimate technique. Can you focus with your balls crushed? The trick kick did work on him. Now do I li win with this honor? No, I'll kick him in the balls. <laughs> Damn, and I told her to watch too. Damn you, karate kid. I'm gonna wash up. But I did kick him in the balls twice, it's a minor win. Pocket steps from changing them. 
And guys, I called Beth and his girlfriend's left him. Curious. Knives. Okay. Oh, hold there, Doctor. That is true. I always wonder about that. For every winner who goes on to great success, there has to be a loser. Who becomes an Alex and gets stuck in a garbage world. I hate when that happens. This place was done for already. meat. Joel? He's got broken ribs. Thank God. What? Hello? Huh. Okay. Make you a canvas for a new kind of violence. Are, are we bopping or. Maybe you didn't. Good for you. They're dead. Hmm. A pink pill. Add the key items. 
Quant is Okota. Offense and defense shattered. Yeah, so his ball throwing's trashed. His tanking days are over until, you know... He gets those ribs fixed. Unless we use rollout, of course. They got the tall machine and twist the school right off. Huh? Tinfoil bandages. Nice. The wall's safe. You think they still are. The house is not what it seems. The land is not to his to own. Loot. 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 No. What's wrong, Joel? Oh yeah, broken ribs. Sorry, just ribbing ya. Don't stay too long, I really need you to actually live. Seriously, like, I only do damage. That's all. Nice berries. Nice berries. They're just nice. That's all they are. It's a nice area. This is like... Especially going down towards Hill, it reminds me of Mushroom Zone from Sonic and Knuckles. The autumn kind of theme. This is actually an unusual amount of plant life for Olaf. Post-Flash Olaf. Let's see what's to the left. More berries. There's a cave I can come out of, but I can't go in at the moment. This is a really nice place. There's not even like people here to fight you, and there's just berries. I only live here. House. It's not what it seems, huh? Hmm. It's kind of like a living room. Won't turn on. Loot here? Paintings. Leviathan and Thomas Hobbes. Scratch marks. Lower right, the last man door commission. Garbage is sandy, number first threat to America. Dog beats man at chess. Found the West Almond Spangler. Silver Angel statuette. Barter item. I guess we'll be doing some bartering soon. Hopefully, the family photos will finally become useful. Bottle. It's been looted. 
Hello. Turn the power on. Joy. Specific key used. What do we get? Exclusive gummy worm. they did there. I wonder if that TV will turn on now. We did turn on the power. Gun. Do you believe in... Sin. Hello there. What are you doing on TV? Is that what he looks like now, or is that a different guy? You, you mean that? A chimichanga? See, this was on the TV in that one weird dinner scene. This is, this is, no, it's zucchini. I'm almost convinced the whole pointless RP is just... Basically, limbo. There's a zucchini. That's after Brad beats him up. Sin. I only know what I've seen. Men giving up themselves just to forget the pain. Living of their own shit and loving it. All they care about is trash. Like it's all there could be. And if you show them hope, they turn on you. Because there ain't no such thing as friend in a world of violence. Just brutality for its own sake and nothing else. So you ask me if I believe in sin. Play the left track, Bob. <laughs> Mystics of trash and violence. This is more like it.
Bye, Rick. Ho, 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 ho. Look at this guy. He's, he's pretty much going to be dead. Oh, 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 thanks for being on the show. Oh, 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 oh this world is just awful. I'm going to go and suck on some joy. Power cut out. Hi. How you doing? Maybe this is Limbo. Maybe this doesn't take place during Lisa, maybe it, it takes place after Lisa, if you know what I mean. I mean, the first game was basically that. World's Last Autumn. Yeah, it's pretty nice, I was commenting about it earlier. It's a nice place you got, see you later. You wait, you live. You fight, you die. So I'm gonna slowly build up my SP while you do that. I, I'm, I'm falling asleep, all the falling asleep right now. This is a very interesting experience at the moment. Wonderful. Okay. That was an experience. Well, yeah, I guess it got some SP out, but I just feels relieved. Well, that's just the debuffs going off. That was something. Oh. What are Joel's doing? Secret? No. Joel. Master <laughs> axe to bring on me. Coming like a big boy. Seems like everyone's losing will to go on nowadays. I wonder if there's loot in this cave. They discovered gods no one ever worshipped. They discovered New Jersey. Get it? Push the handle. Yes. Shortcut? Yes, it is. Look up, the soil's all wrong now. Hey, aren't you the... Stan has scratches all over. You're the guy from earlier, right? Don't lax. Take some soup? Hell yeah. On me. Yes. Technically. Fine, fuck you. Let me see if you'll just give it to me or not. No, everything's always gotta be solved with violence in the banjo.
stance up. Let's get some soup. Sorry, buddy. Well, that, that thing hits hard, actually, when it hits. Oh, yeah, I should probably equip this. Alright, we're going back to Joel. Be a bit of a walk. Hey, Joel, I got a trauma kit, and I just had to, like, brutally murder a man. Yeah, we, we actually do legitimately need you around. We had the option of keeping for later, I wonder. Good. Let's pop. Oh, you don't want to go in there. Yeah, you know, oh, okay, it's up to you. There's a little bit of a poet, like, kind of good directing there. He doesn't even say anything. He just comes back out. Like, there's nothing to be, need to be said. Like, he knows. There's a campfire up there. I could rest. First, check out the cave. Tall shells. All that white flash left. Yeah, that's... Intimidating. I might be able to avoid finding them, so... I'm just gonna avoid. Like, I don't think I'm gonna get any new skills or anything to leveling up. Learn to suck eggs or you won't survive. Actually, I should've dropped right there. I made a horrible mistake. I got to fight that one. I should've dropped down, I didn't think. No, I'm fine. Ooh boy, that was close. Hey, Lost Boys. Cormac. Yeah, I suppose I could kill those things in your way and maybe help you out, but I don't think I will. place. Champion's belt. I lower my defense, but it's slight increase in its speed and skill cost reduction that might be more inherently useful. Two mud pies. This call. Good for you. I hope it comes someday. 
Drawing of a family. More than the mud civilization. Whole new phrase the term mud hut. Definitely loot there. Fassah! Dude, our mud pie's good. They make you feel kind of weird, but if you use them out of battle, it doesn't matter, eventually they'll wear off. So they're actually pretty useful, actually, for healing. Coming. Hi, who are you? MC Hammer? Did you come before me? The walker of walls and the biggest of pants. Teach me your techniques. First, you get the boom box. Spin Doctor and he plays his pipe. Everybody leaves with him. What? Man, that franchise is intense. I would know. I am the man in the biggest pants. Really? Are you gonna give it to send mags afterwards? First, take your loot. Die Coca Cola. Oof, almost walked off the cliff. Okay, I see how this works. I wonder if he's got these nice berries, too. Oh, they're nice. Jason Pike. Warlord Balloon Pants, they caught me! Get the levitate. Mm, it did lower the costs. I wonder if we can bring him back down to the ground. Let's do the twisted stance. We're starting out strong. Actually, let's see. We can mind game. Yes, we can. We need to bring him back down to the ground. Down to the crown. Do we just wait till you eventually land? So 
Stop throwing bass. Maybe you throw a ball at him and we'll get him down. Bottle. Time for the pain. Bad timing on that. By location. Okay. I'm gonna go all out. A lot of bottles. Fluxing pretty hard. But I know the minor iris. Do it! Then we got 10 mags. You have been humbled. Hey buddy old pal, you bad? City. That guy was a little weird. Can we rest here. It's not a gang. Just rest. Whatever. What he said. Who are you meeting? I feel like this city's just gonna be hell. Hopefully we're not ambushed waking up. Yes, we are. Ah! Everyone else is dead. I, I have no op I have no control over it. He's choosing it. Hey. You bastard. Defense decreased. 
Achilles decrease your rupture. I'm dying. Joel. Then I'm all times for the gun in effect not be loaded. I feel like that guy's giving me the buzz over this series. He lost a pink pill. Come on, Joel. I'm dying. My stats are like done. Come on, buddy. I feel like he's a bad guy. I feel like he wanted him for a reason, but I could be wrong. Not sure if this was a good thing to do or not. No use. He went for a secret passage. I see how I've made us go through a maze. A way out of here. Isn't this the exit right here? He walks among saints. There's better be something worth it after doing all this. There's a one and two here. So we need to find that switch one. This is right here. That wasn't too bad. I might reload later, see what happens if I follow him. Hi, are you the healing bird of healing? No, you're just a guy in a crow suit. The flowers are pretty. I wonder if the doctor came out of this direction. Like, that's a thing right there.
Yeah, Alex lived a hard life. Maybe not as hard as Bran, but still. There's a bus stop. Hey, how you doing? The pink pill. Wasn't that the thing we had? Thank you, random mask person. Who is unusually kind in a world that's really terrible usually. Time for Vaporwave bus trip. We've got the flamingos. None of the affinity guys are still on and about. If I had to say, I wouldn't necessarily... In a lot of ways, I don't really feel this is a Lisa fan game. It's kind of weird. It's kind of its own thing in a lot of ways. It just has the kind of skin of Lisa a bit, but... Like, writing, and even atmosphere-wise, it feels like very different. It's not necessarily enjoyable for the Lisa, but it's distinct enough where I'm kind of like... Having fun in an odd way, like that right there is crazy. Literally the vapor it's literally a vaporwave civilization. Oh, that was the end. Wow. So that's it for Lisa the Pointless. A kind of very interesting experience. One of the actually more unique ones I've played of these kind of games. Um, I stand by what I said where I don't think it's very similar to Lisa at all. Uh, it's almost unrecognizable as a fan game aside from like this art style and kind of the skin going on there. But writing, pacing, even battle-wise, it's kind of its own beast. And due to its nature, I think it takes a certain kind of person to enjoy this. Uh, it's not really actually for lore, deepest lore, kind of self-storytelling people. It's a little too subtle sometimes, to the point where it's a little hipster. Um, and it's kind of very surreal in its subtleties. Which, like I said, takes a very particular kind of person to enjoy. Uh, the RPG battles are fun, although they do they get kind of formulatic, because you kind of just debuff with Joel, and then smack him with your strongest attack and kind of repeat. But I did enjoy the nature of the difficulty and the kind of rationing of items I had to do to kind of survive, so I always did feel like I was on the edge of survival, um, not something I could just breeze through comfortably. The sprite work and music were all actually really good, actually. Indistinguishable from Lisa, in that sense. But this was definitely one of those things that feels like maybe there's more of a story to be told if the whole series was kind of out. Um, I know there is supposed to be, like a, like I said, a cell storytelling going on, that I'm bringing that up again. And some NPCs are connected, and there's some, like, things about the nature of the infinity and whatnot, but it's told us in a way where I don't really feel like going to look for it. Uh, the original Lisa had a lot of motivation, 
and pretty good pacing, which I enjoyed greatly. It borrowed heavily from Hiro Kojima directing-wise, minus the overt uh, movie references, more of a Fist of the North Star reference, if anything. Um, and Dingling hasn't been into this. But um, Lisa, Lisa, and even its expansion, or DLC, Lisa the uh, Joyful, I, there was never quite a point where I disliked those games. I always feel kind of motivated to keep going on. Pointless has a lot of, like, kind of side-off stuff. And I think the pacing is a lot different. Not everyone's cup of tea. Did definitely actually enjoy this. But I'm not necessarily going to say it's actually a uh, well-written or um, good game. It's kind of just like a pointless adventure. Which I've said quite a few times as i played this. And we don't really know nearly enough about the main characters for me to make an opinion whether or not I enjoy anyone in the cast. Um, or anything. And everyone else is just kind of like a one-off that dies. So yeah, anyway. Thank you all for watching me play Lisa the Pointless. I'll see you guys later. And take it easy.